But another thing that you can certainly do is attend the smooth summer splash. And Kay Solo, our very own here on Hello Nigeria, is here to tell you all about the smooth summer splash and exactly what you can expect from the event. Thank you so much for joining me on set. It's a pleasure to finally it's, sit it's on It's so this, weird um, to have you sitting I'm next to me. You, Normally, K Solo is behind the scenes working to make sure that Olive and I are looking delectable on set. But today you are here with me. So tell me, what is the Smooth Summer Splash? Okay, um, the Smooth Summer Slam, right? This is, like it said, mm. season, for instance. I mean, it's been on since like three years. But what we're trying to do this year is try to take it a lot, a notch higher now, you know, mm. like, because we've... For the smooth smooth time, it's a, it's a time where mm. we try to, you know, bring, for instance, now you've had people go out, travel outside this country, yeah. you have people being, you know, different parts of the countries and all of that, different parts of the world. But for this summer now, I mean, our families are together. So what we're trying to do basically is just to create that ambience mm. where, you know, families, you know, loved ones can have a time together. But now this time around, it's not because you're going to the cinemas, it's about having a Nigerians in one place having the time of their life. I mean, even after this time, when they get to go back, they have that, you know, that memory to, to keep behind them and then the reminisce that Nigerian has something for them. What would you say it is that makes this beach party the beach party of the year? Okay, for, for instance, I mean, a lot of people go to the beach, for instance. Mm. We're talking about a beach party where, I don't know if you've been to Las Vegas before, and no, you know, I want to go though. Yeah, Who you know, wants to take me? <laughs> don't worry, there, there, there's good time. You know what they say about the Las Vegas <laughs> yeah. party? That what goes in Las Vegas stays in Las Vegas. Mm. And I tell you the truth, one thing that is big about this one is like whatever goes on there is something that you will never, never see anywhere in the world before. You're talking about a venue where, you know, families can come and have picnics mm. together. You're talking about where people can play football together. Mm. You're talking about a, a serene environment where you have massive security. You mm. have, um, and we're talking about the private beach of the upper of Elegoshi, for instance, now. Mm. We're talking about where, you know, for everything that you want, we're talking about where you have your asun, you have your barbecue, for everything that All you want, get everything that you're going to get anywhere in the world, games, is going to be on the beach. And, I mean, where else do you want to, when you have water by your side at the same time, what else do you want to do on a sunny day? What else do you want to do? I mean, Kesola is asking, what else do you want to do? And then, you know what we're trying to do, is basically, is about bringing all of these things together and then having different family, you know, having to find out their own time, their own space, their own kind of, um, you know, what, what suits themselves. We'll create that space for you. You know, even the kids are welcome to come to the beach as well. We're trying to create that space for you where you can actually give your family a treat. Know you fully well that, uh, you know, the holiday, you know, is just around nice, the corner. Nice, nice. Is it a paid event or is it free? Or... Yeah, it's paid. But for the kids, it's going to be free. The kids can come in with their parents, but the parents... The and and fee, the grown ones. Yeah, the grown ones get to pay a token fee of a 2,000 naira just to have the best time okay. of their life now. Okay, interesting, interesting. Now, Kesolo, you've been in the entertainment industry yourself for quite a while, and sure. we always have events in Lagos. You know, they say Lagos is the center of excellence, but I believe that Lagos is firstly the center of events, right? For there real. is something going on all the time. And over time, when, you know, trends change, etc., events change as well. Tell oh. us about the transition, because you've been around in the industry for, what, 12 years now? Yeah, more, more than 12 years now. Mm. For, for instance, all right, let me just um, refresh your memory back. Like, about, say, 10 years there about ago, I started a program called The Underground. That's where I actually predicted that if you give this industry another five years from now, then the entertainment industry in Nigeria will be like a bank mm. where, you know, every state, every artist in their mm. own locality can find a small you know, events to get paid for and then, you know, and for me, that time, all right, a lot of people would not give artists, I mean, these young coming ones, they never give them a chance to, you know, exhibit themselves and everything. So I started the program then to start to promote these ones and everything. So before you knew what was going on, these artists started to get their own name, you know, put on the standard time and all of that. So the artists now, the small artists now, they become really big now that if you look at the, I mean, the sounds and songs that we have these days, Majority of the new upcoming rising artists now, they're turning out new songs, new, new, beautiful, beautiful songs. So for me, the, the market has grown and, and you can only expect it to be more than what it is right now. So what we're, one of the things we're going to be selling again at this particular mm. season uh, episodes now is that majority of those young artists, you're talking about the likes of the Mayoko, mm. the King um, George, the JC, the, all of the new upcoming artists, believe me, with beautiful sounds, they will have the opportunity to actually, you know, showcase themselves in the front of the old Nigerians, both in diaspora and those ones. Besides that, again, the Wazobia, you know, family have done greatly again to mm -hmm. still give some benefits to those that will probably be at home at a later time mm -hmm. to still get a chance to 
to see the events okay. as well. So how can people RSVP for the events or should people just turn up to Elegushi at yeah, what I mean, time? People, and... we, 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 the, the show is on Saturday, mm. 18th of um, August, that's mm. tomorrow. And the show starts at about, say, say 2 p.m. in mm. the afternoon till, say, 12 in the night. Mm. So the gate, like I said, is 2,000 naira. So, I mean, we, we sell tickets online as well. So people can get to buy tickets at nigerticket.com. Uh, people can get to buy tickets online as well. And then we're actually giving out space again for those that have, um, you know, things to sell as soon, make um, barbecue, shawarma. We're also space giving out to all of these people as well. So basically, that's, it. that's what's going on. Interesting, interesting. So if you are looking for what to do this Saturday, you can head over to Elegushi. If you're an adult, you're paying 2,000 naira. And if you're a kid, of course, you are going for free. It's K Solo's event, the Smooth Summer Slam. And of course, you can only expect the best. So that is one thing for you to do this weekend. K Solo, thank you so much for sharing this information. And also to mention that the poster with more information is also on the Wazobia Max social media pages. So if you do want some more information on where to get your ticket online, etc., then you can head over to the Wazobia Max social media pages and all the information is there for you. Okay, Solo, thank you. Have a bag, baby. <laughs> to enjoy more of these our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.